Hi. I'm just getting ready. I'm a little bit late. But I'm, I'm ready now. I'm just organising Evie. So today, I've been searching, 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 thinking what to do. And um, are you going to sign for me? I can. We can use different prints today. So I don't know if you saw the um, uh, post earlier about it. all you need is a couple of brushes, maybe a few. Can't find the camera. <laughs> a few cotton buds all bound together. I've been doing this earlier with someone, with Mark, and gave it a try out. So, I've set everybody else up with paint, except me. So what I'll do is, just quickly do some of that and we can crack on as time is. Do you want me to show what it is you're going to be making? Um, yeah, you can hold it up, it's yeah. pretty rough. Isn't it? That's just an experiment. An experiment it was. So we're doing some sort of colourful, oh, yeah. okay, colourful bonsai tree sort of thing. Oh, a Japanese maple or so this cherry one, blossom. What I like about this is you can just keep just a few colours because I know that Evie absolutely loves Japan and everything Japanese. Um, so I know that she really likes Japanese um, blossom on the trees. So you can just use a few colours and keep it really reduced and simple or you can use many colours and have it really bright and colourful so it's your choice really. Right so what I'm going to start with because that other one was yellow you can do a yellow background if you want um, I'm going to do light blue this time because I like it better so I've mixed a bit of dark blue with white and I'm just going to no, I didn't wash my brush properly, so it's sort of green. <laughs> it makes it look cool, that nice. Yeah, it makes it look a bit different, I suppose. There are no mistakes, as Mr. Ross would say. And that's all over the background, yep, so take over. your time, plenty of time. Yeah, I've liked some of the um, pictures that people have been sending. I think we'll have enough soon to do like a little online. Oh, a bit of red in there. <laughs> online um, oh, exhibition. Good. I was yeah. trying to look for the word. Well, next week is what would be the end of term for schools. So um, we'll work on next week. Um, we'll start to put it all together. Then the week after that, we're going to have a little bit of a break. So we won't be doing any art on that. That's when we'll be able to prepare um, a little bit of a PowerPoint, hopefully. But do please keep sending us um, your photographs of your work. And it can be the actual photograph of the art, or it could be a photograph of you making the art, if you're happy for us to share that. Um, we're going to put it into an actual book, so we'll stick it down and put it into a book. And we're going to save it and share it online as well and on Facebook and on, probably on our website as well so send it in um, it's the email address is um, info at inspirationcreative.co.uk cool thank you she should be a TV presenter I don't know what I've done here, but hey. There seems to be a little bit of um, red going on there, like an aurora borealis. Huh? Yeah. Like most of the stuff I do, it goes wrong. And then it goes right, so I'm quite happy with that. So next I'm going to use a bit of black. And you've got a brush there. Yeah, just use a brush. About that thin. And I'm going to start from about there. Does that look needlish to you? Yeah, about there. And 
I'm just going to do that. It doesn't have to be a straight line because trees aren't straight by any means. Even the ones that are trained. Now I'm going to do a couple of branches. Put as many in as you want. They're going to get covered anyway, so. Hello to Darren and Sean and Anita and Morgan. Nice to see you and anyone else who's watching. Hey, it's my sister-in-law. Hello, Anita. Hope you're painting. I want to see your work now. Don't forget the quiz tonight, Anita. Family quiz. They went out last week. <laughs> oh, they went always out, don't they? In the garden. Yeah. Got to stroll along the Thames. Stroll along the Thames, don't they? Leave my um. Oh, sorry. hello, Rachel. <coughs> Got my T-shirt. <laughs> you should try that on one week. Let's I'll, have a look at yeah, that. Yeah, I'll try it on one week. <laughs> right, so there we are. So I'm going to add, I don't think there'll be a man in there. I'm going to add a few more colours like a bit of red, like just a blob on my palette, which I pointed out today was my mother in law. She, she lent us a plate once and Turns into a palette. <laughs> oh, hang on. She'll never see that again. <laughs> There's a dog underneath it. I hope she's not watching. She'll have me over for that. Oh, can I nick that? Yeah, there you go. Anita oh, says that she's it. learning and you're inspiring her. Oh. <laughs> right. Pete, show. Eh? Yeah, Pete, show. Yeah. No, I was acting. I've got that for acting. you. Acting. Right. I'm going to get my. Um, what are they called? Cotton buds. Cotton buds. Should we give, should we give people a time to, to catch up with that? Yeah, because I'm just know. looking at how quickly Eve is going. <laughs> we need a packed. little bit of time. It's fine. Mm. Take your time. Take time. <laughs> Just notice so, Evie's got one of my t-shirts on, a Batman t-shirt. Quick, come show. Yeah, that do. That's fine. So, some of the ideas that you can use, if you haven't got any of the, I, don't, I don't know what the sign is, I'm saying cotton buds. <laughs> if, you haven't, if you haven't got any of those, um, you can use a hairbrush, and like an old one, hairbrush, and then you can dab that. Um, if you haven't got that, then maybe you could just use some pencils and tie them together so that you've got the ends, maybe milk bottle lids, or pop, pop, pop. the other idea was Coca-Cola bottles. Um, where is it? It's not a Coke bottle, it's under the camera. Oh yeah, so this one isn't Coke because we couldn't find one, um, but on the bottom, you've got these little ridges that are quite useful. So maybe you could dab those in and dab those all around the paint, but it's to, make um, dots, lots and lots of dots, quickly, rather than using just one brush and dabbing. It would take a long time. You could try that. Um, but anything else that you can think of, type it in, because we were just trying to think of what else could you do that you could put together to make lots of dots together. Maybe Barbie hands. You could take all the Barbie hands off your children's dolls and put those together. Yeah, there, there we go. One of these, like that. Take Never. his hands off. Yeah, and it'll be like that. <laughs> or also for finished. this, can you sign for me? Yeah. Also for this, you can use, because I used it at a wedding once, um, you can get ink or you can use paint, fingerprint, because Trevor and Lindsay had the tree with everybody's fingerprints on it, didn't they, and names. So you can do that. I'm not doing that today, just so you know. Well, it was a nice way, actually, of um, saving all of their family and friends' fingerprints. Um, that could be used maybe for crime. Only joking, not really. Um, but, um, yeah, it was just a nice personal keepsake as well of having all the fingerprints of all the people that were at the wedding. Um, I think 
it was on a white background, wasn't it? Yeah, it's just white. Yeah. Mm. So they could be seen easily. So hopefully by now you all have got a black tree with branches coming off of it. Um, and so now Pete, uh, Pete has got the cotton buds and he's dabbed them in what? Um, a range of the colours. So it, doesn't, it doesn't matter if they get mixed up. So yeah, all. so you can just use one colour or you can mix up colours. So you can see it's pretty messy. Again, if it was me, everything would be pink. Oh, yeah, which you could I do think that. Evie is doing. Yay. Yeah. So, got this, and you just. I'm going to bring the camera over so we can get a little bit of a close up view of that. So, no speaking, so I can't sign. So you can get the shape, get the shape. <laughs> That's really weird looking at that and signing it. It's all back to front. <laughs> can we take a little peek at yours, Evie? Yeah, no. Not yet. No. Okay, save that. So if you get the basic shape of a tree. Stand back and have a look because you get sort of crooked or whereas I always do. I mean, you can go as big, you can go right out there if you want, or you can keep it subtle. I can have a question. When is it that you add the glitter onto this one? No, it's not going to be any glitter. Oh, sorry, can I answer you again? Ask me again. Okay, I'll ask you again. <coughs> uh, when do you add the glitter? I'm sorry, I don't speak English. <laughs> do you know what? I'm going to make some of this artwork purely out of glitter later. I'll show you. Hello, Bex. But is, is that environment friendly? Yeah, this Glitter? Is, yeah. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Watch her. So you can add more or... We're going to be adding this later on to YouTube, to our Inspiration Inclusive Fan It page, and you'll be able to find all of the art that we've done up to now on there and um, feel free to share it with people and um, whoever might be interested so in also this. on this if you think about um you sign are you signing for me or are you just not um you could do like if you think about cherry blossom trees it sometimes you get all the leaves on the floor so you could always go in on that not like i've done of course because that was that was all there but just do it lightly Oh, it gives it a sort of a base, I suppose, mm -hmm. a floor. Make it a bit like that, a little bit like that. Ah, oh, look at that pretty. Am I allowed to do some now? Um, hold on, let me just get a bit of red, put it in the white. Are you attempting are you trying to make pink? Yeah, it's mainly pink. Look. Am I allowed to make it myself? Uh, no, because you'll go over pink. Look, look yeah, at that. Just go with it. Just go, go with it. Pink. Mm. Yeah. Just that bit there. Bit more. Bit more white, please. A bit more white. Just on that. That's lovely there. That's it. Lovely. Thank you. I'm going to use the other end because you've got all sorts of stuff going on there. Mm. There we go. Okay. Yeah, that's all right. I can dab this. Yep. Yep. I like that. It's funny now I've got a bit of green in the front, so. So 
from something to you. So, um, is it better to um, wait for the background to dry first? Or well, no, it's, it it's fine. It doesn't. Okay, so I'm going to carry on. If you just carry on signing, that's lovely. So, my beautiful bit of artwork here. Um, all created by me, the artist. And, you've got to be careful, you can add too much and it just swamps the whole thing. Okay, well, I think that's just about the right amount of Because, okay, right, give me that. Stop! Yeah. <laughs> oh man, <sighs> painful. <sighs> yeah, but sometimes it's, it's nice to see the branches behind a bit, you so you can see through. And so is it time really now to have a look at other people's? I, yeah, I wouldn't mind seeing Evie, so you're going to bring it over? Wait, no, oh, she's just doing a bit to... of Japanese writing. Well, Sean has, um, she's created something <laughs> with her dots. I'm going to frame this, this I'm going to keep this. This is a picture, I think, of Peter. Look at that, that's fantastic. <laughs> that's Peter with hair. That's Bob Ross. That's Bob Ross. Peter Ross. <laughs> if you continue, so Evie, well done. Oh, you're not going to put an afro wig on there, are you? Maybe. It means I'll have to grab it. Bob Ross has got a voice like chocolate, so I don't think. Oh, look, I'm using a brush now. So if you see, if you see things you want to change, change it, have a look. The afro's a little bit squashed there. Hi. Right. I'm just gonna wash it off a bit there and uh Yeah, I'm gonna get my cloth and I'm gonna wipe my cloth and I'm gonna take the wig off because that is horrible. <laughs> you lucky people, you get a little bit of comedy with your artwork. Sorry <laughs> about that. Right, Evie is ready to come and show her work. I like this. This is from a Japanese point of view, very nice. Hey, you can Japanese. you hold it from the corners so that you can hold it upwards? Mm -hmm. It's got some Japanese in it, so I can translate that. Wow, so um, what, what does, does that mean? What does it actually say in Japanese first? It says the blossom tree. Wow. Very nice. And can you say it in Japanese? No, but I can get Google Translate too. <laughs> cool. Pop it down. Right, so, you know my, my favourite thing? is masking tape. So you, you can always pull it off and get your little... I love, I love how that makes a really neat line on the edges. Mm. It changes the whole thing, I think. Go on then, Evie, say, say the word. Japanese blossom. What's the word? Sakura Come in. no ki. Say again. Sakura no ki. Excellent. Blossom. The blossom tree. Well done. <laughs> Very nice. Right, I ripped my paint in, but ah, never mind. That's alright. <gasps> Yay! Look at that. I'm quite pleased with that, actually. And I, From I'm, here, I'm you can really see that flowers. pink um, line on the side. But if I bring this a little bit closer. There we go. Blossom tree. So, thank you very much for watching. Yep, we'll see you. you next week. See you next week. Bye. Bye.